Welcome back, everybody. 8-11 is your time. And joining us this morning, Jennifer Olihan with Austin Animal Center. And she has brought along Rio this morning. Mm -hmm. And Rio can walk on his hind legs. Yes, She's he can. She's been trying to convince me of that for the past <laughs> two minutes. And we have been trying to get him to do it, but no go so far. Sensory overload here, I think. He's, <laughs> he's looking at all the people and all the cameras. But and he is so sweet. He is so sweet. He is really, he really is. smart. So um, he is staying in our animal protection officer's office right now because we're still out of kennels. And and walking so, like a person, apparently. Yeah, they've taught him to walk on his hind legs. They've Wait, taught Jennifer, him. Jennifer, let's try again. Walk like a person, Rio. <laughs> walk like a person. <laughs> He's like, mm, I smell all the dogs over here. <laughs> yeah, but he knows sit. He knows high five. He does great in the car. He's four years old, so he's, um, you know, Rio. young middle-aged dog. But he's out of that puppy stage where he's not destroying things. Yay. Like I said, he, he stays in that office. He doesn't touch any of the papers or the pens, the stuff on the desk. Your shoes. Yeah, exactly. I mean, and there's lots of stuff in that office that he could tear apart. But he totally leaves it alone. He's such a sweetheart. He's really, really good good boy real yeah. real come on walk like a person real walk walk like a person <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll post a video on our Facebook okay. page yeah okay. tune well, in for that that's good <laughs> and you actually have some sad news I don't like this you had 114 surrenders in a matter of three days yeah. last week yeah just in a few oh. days we had 115 dogs oh. um, and that's a mixture of owner surrenders and stray pets but so we really want to remind people to, when you're coming to adopt a dog, make sure you're being really honest with yourself about what you can handle. Um, you know, some people will adopt a dog just based on this breed that they've loved their whole life, maybe a boxer. Um, and if you're not an active person, a boxer is maybe not a great mix yeah. for you. Yeah. And so that's not to say that you could never own a boxer, but you really have to look at the personality of the animal and not the size and not the breed. Um, and just, just be really honest with yourself. A lot of people love puppies and then we end up with a lot of one and two year old dogs in the shelter once they've not, you know, been trained and, and really cared for and then people get tired of them and bring yeah. them to the shelter and so um yeah puppies are cute but guess what they're gonna chew on your shoes they are if so you hard don't train them exactly i mean oh. i i do not recommend puppies for first-time dog owners i mean there are people who can do it and are super dedicated but you really have to work on training and lay that foundation so that you have a good dog things that are cute when they're two months old are not cute when they're two years right. old um so especially you know, if you can't train them right exactly and it's a huge part of keeping austin no Hill. We come on here and we talk about how the shelter is full every single week. I mean, we're still almost 50 kennels over capacity right now with dogs. And so keeping dogs out of the shelter, we can only adopt so many out if they're still coming in. Right. So we really need to keep animals out of the shelter, making good adoption matches as part of that, microchipping, spay neuter, um, ID tags, all of that are resources you can get at the Austin Animal Center and are really, really important for keeping Austin no kill. No, absolutely, absolutely. And just as an example of how good Rio is, can we please take a shot of him? <laughs> he has not barked. He hasn't done anything. No, he's, he's been perfect. so good. See, he is not a puppy. He's four years old, and Rio's been with you guys what four or five months, mm -hmm. and he hasn't he hasn't chewed up anything. No, <laughs> he's no. Just I a mean, perfect he's, companion. Right. He really yeah. is perfect. I mean, he's very chill right now. He does have some energy, so he'll want someone who will take him for walks, right. maybe a runner or something. Yeah. But he's amazing. He is. He is. All right. And if you're interested in Rio, you can go by the Austin Animal Center, address 7201, Lavander Loop. They open up at 11 today. And they have a whole slew of other dogs, brand new dogs they just got in. Please go by and uh, check them all out. But, of course, you can always check out other dogs and cats looking for a good home. Just log on to the pet section of KVU.com.